Hello friends, in this video we are going to discuss how to use Clear Scanner. It is a good app to scan our document and convert it as an image or a PDF file. So this is an interface, I am only using the app, various documents are available. I will tell you step by step. Select the camera symbol in the which is in the bottom. Okay. Now, okay, I have a paper. Okay, my camera is focusing on it. See in the top, I am having an auto flash symbol. Then, if I don't want to auto flash, I can remove the auto flash. This is a dark symbol. It will add some brightness. So, this stands for okay, no auto flash. So, now I am adding auto flash and in the right corner, in the bottom right corner, I am having a document. So, you want to scan a single document to be single only. If I click it again, it will scan two pages. That means our document is going to have two pages lost for the two scan. I will demo it one by one. And now I am selecting a single page. This is the zoom option which is given at the bottom. You can zoom in and zoom out. Okay. Then I am correctly selecting the, the document and, select and clicking the camera. Okay. Now, this page will appear. See in the bottom, we are having a various symbol. So, left one, okay, the left one is okay, which is a particular area is cropped and selected. So, to select the whole area, I have to select the next symbol, okay. Whole area got selected. I can, if I want a specific area, I can move down. You can move up and, and I have shrink from the left, I have shrink from the right, okay. I have to select the appropriate area which is needed for me, okay. I want entire area, again, I go to the, the, the bottom and click the second symbol. Okay, fine now. I am choosing it. So, this is having a left and right rotation. So, this is left rotation. Okay. The third symbol is left rotation. And the next symbol is a right rotation. Okay. Once you select everything properly, then what you will do? So, for example, everything properly, then what you will do? You have to select the text symbol. Now, your image will appear like this. See in the top. First icon stands for original image. Our original image looks like this. I want to make it as a, a photo. The image as a photo, it will look like this. I want this image as a document. It will look like this. It is a clear means, okay, it will be look like this. Okay, so I want it as a document now. And I have to select the tick symbol at the bottom. Now, my image is ready. To share the uh, image, okay, to different apps, I have to select the SAR symbol. Okay. So, I have to give a, it is first option is to share as a PDF or an image. So, I am changing it as an image. I am giving a name. Okay. First. Name is a first. And I am choosing an app and email. So, I am sending it to an email. Okay. So, first project as a, you can add all the subject and everything you add. Okay. And you have to compose your mail and you can set it the mail same. Okay. So likewise, okay, likewise, you are able to share it to different apps. Now I am demonstrating the second option. Second option is I have okay. So now I am going to select the camera. I am selecting two images. Now the document contains two images. I am scanning the first image. Okay. Automatically it will appear as a one appear as a 1. So, now I am scanning the second image and okay, I am selecting the camera symbol. Second image got scanned. Now, the document contains two, two images. Okay. So, the next page, we are having a border adjustment automatically adjust the borders. We can I have choose it. Filters, original photo, documents and clear are come here and the colors, okay, black and white color will come here. I am selecting it as a color and I am selecting OK. Okay. So, now the, corp, uh, the cropping area Okay, so the left bottom is an, an auto auto uh, cropping. Okay, now it is properly selected. Auto cropping is selected automatically. So, for example, it's any like all the area got covered. If I select the leftmost bottom symbol, auto cropping, it will be properly cropped the paper. Okay, then we are having the same left right and uh, uh, left rotation, right rotation. Everything is same. Okay, I'm select the second image. Okay, I'm selecting all the area. I'm choosing okay all the area. So again, I'm adjusting it by hand. Okay, I'm selecting it. Okay, the document got processed. 
Okay, same way I can share. I can change the there's a PDF file. I can give some name, second project. Okay, and I can share it to various apps. Okay, I can set my password here. I can okay, I can set a password. I can touch this password. Okay, password enabled or disabled. I can change my password here. Okay, I'm changing a password. Test two. Okay, we are able to set a document and we are able to clear a password and we have to share it. Okay, by email or somebody something else, I can share it. Okay, fine. We'll uh, see various options which are available. The top. Okay, this is a PDF file. Okay, want to open a PDF file? I select the PDF. Okay, it will open as a PDF file. Okay, contain two pages. Okay, so the again I am having an edit and share. For example, two file got selected. I want to select only one. Okay, now one got selected. Now two got selected. So I can uh, I can change. Okay, edit select means I can select all and deselect all are available. So the number of selection I can adjust it by using this edit select. Okay, now I am selecting the all again. So by giving a edit select. Okay, I can change of two. I can choose only one. Okay, I can left out another one. Likewise, I can change my selection. Okay, before sharing, rename. I am able to rename the document. Test two. Okay, next option is PDF setting. So page size is okay. I am choosing it as A4. Various page sizes are available. Like page orientation, it is now it is a, a okay portrait. Now I can change this as landscape or auto orientation may be given. Okay, then uh, fixed with our uh, with the height of the image, or we can fill it for the entire page. Okay, we can choose these options. Okay, I'm choosing as a portrait. For example, I'm choosing a landscape document. Okay, it will be in the landscape format. Okay. So PDF setting, I'm is good that I'm I'm setting it as a portrait. Okay, fine. So these are all the options here. So, for example, then uh, import uh, from a file. Okay, choose an import option. I can import a file. Okay, any file which already is having. Okay, I can import it from here or from a folder, like a large file or from a folder. I can choose this. Okay, I am not choosing anything. I am about to clear scanner. Okay. Likewise, I may be I am able to import a file. I am able to create a new blank page. Okay, new blank page got selected. Here I am having a scanned image. This means I can add any one of the scanned image again. Okay, here this blank page. Okay, or okay, for example, the plus plus symbol and create a signature. I can create a beautiful signature. Then I can scan the existing signature. If it is available, I can scan the existing signature. I can import in any image from the gallery, or I can add some text. I can add some text here. Okay. So likewise, okay, this option is very useful. Then here, okay, I can change my theme. Okay, it's a black and white theme. Now I will adjust my size. Okay, size of something which I have typing. For example, I am typing something. Okay, hi. Okay, now we come like this. Okay, I can change the colors. I can change. I can change the size. Okay, I can change the thickness and lightness. Okay, I can able to create a document like this. Okay, so once it's completed, I have to give it done. So fine. So these are all the options are available. So next we are able to save it to gallery. Okay, it will be saved to gallery. So few hours will appear. Okay, same way. I am able to save the storage and go and select a particular storage. Okay, for example, okay, I am selecting it is in download defaultly. I am clicking uh, the folder. Okay, the storage. Okay, the folder. I can change my folder now. I can change my folder now. It is not debate note pro. Yes, can folder is selected. Use this folder. Okay, automatically it will be added. Some sometimes we have a sync sync problem. We have to choose some other folder. Okay, I am choosing a download folder as a default. Okay, download got selected, and I am just writing over the existing file. This file is already available; it's overwritten. Okay, if we remove this, the file will be saved in the other copy. Okay, these are all the options are available. Then, so working and then setting. Okay, the setting I can choose my color of this app. I am choosing it as a brown means. Okay, the app color will be changed. Use an app camera. 
okay uh, batch scan support okay app can use in app camera giving you permission to my use my camera image quality i can change it as a high i can change it to medium auto serve to gallery image will give it is simple the gallery will be saved automatically okay within the gallery and uh, document name okay the pdf uh, the image name is pdf and document name size cfo orientation so everything is coming here so if i am able to give a default uh, to subject name and ocr language is in english ocr stands for the optical characterization okay so auto sync to the, uh, the the drive may be enabled auto sync to the wifi so mobile network okay this is already selected so next is next is setting setting is we have see the setting next is the sync to google drive automatically we can sync the app to the your google drive so go select the connect to google drive and choose appropriate email id that will automatically synced next backup file you want to create a backup file you can create a backup and give a save means the backup will create automatically you want to restore any file you can select the restore option okay backup and restore option then next is okay trash my data files will get stored in the trash to remove this okay i can give a the cross symbol to empty the trash so next is the tutorial of the app is given here you can see okay then how to capture image and how to add a multiple pages everything i explain is given here to tell like increase the size of the font i can decrease the size of the font by using the uh, zoom in zoom out of the bottom right corner okay next okay i love this app that means that you are able to uh, write a review comment in a google play store okay then uh, pro version you want to purchase it okay you have to pay 100 rupees for indian cost okay in your country how to check it the cost may vary as per the currency value and feature request if you have any doubts or feedback you have to give a yes can at gmail.com okay they will answer you properly then you can uh, read about the uh, about clear scanner okay so far all contributed and about the clear scanner project it will be given here so this is very that's it now this is a very very useful app so again there is a symbol okay to automatically sync with the uh, drive you can click there symbol this is the second symbol uh, which is in the cloud uh, symbol uh, in the top right okay then you can uh, select your email id and sync with your drive okay so these are all the this is very useful app so this is then you can search a particular document for example i'm searching test okay test will appear you can search using a search symbol okay so these are these are this version is existing version is 5.6.0 okay the latest they will update continuously this is a very useful app. okay then you have you have to quit from this app okay that's it okay okay they will allow you want to exit you given exit so okay that's it uh, thanks for watching this video so we have clearly demonstrated the way to use the uh, clear scanner Thank you.